and continue to make good progress on the ground. Combat operations have met with resistance in a number of locations, the most notable of which is in the vicinity of An Nasiriya. United States Marines defeated an enemy attack there while sustaining a number of killed and wounded in the sharpest engagement of the war thus far. Also in the vicinity of An Nasiriya, United States Army supply convoy was ambushed by irregular Iraqi forces. A number of American service members were wounded in that action, and as a result of that action, 12 U.S. service members are reported missing and then ambushed them. So uh, there, there are a number. I, I can tell you for a fact that we are uh, definitely missing 12 Army soldiers uh, that are unaccounted for, some of whom I believe ended up on uh, Baghdad television. We, we have uh, a number of killed in the action in An Nasiriya with the Marines. Uh, I believe that that number will remain less than 10. Baghdad, showing Iraqis looking and shooting at the water, looking for... No planes have been shot down. No pilots have parachuted. Uh, but I did note that the Iraqis were searching for what they thought to be a downed American pilot. And you can see by their actions shooting into the water that uh, their search and rescue techniques leave a lot to be desired. Uh, here in uh, the areas that uh, we've been encountering, we're not. That there were several incidents reported today in which there were types of uh, behavior that I can only describe as ruses that were perpetrated by the enemy. In one incident, uh, a, uh, a flag of surrender was uh, uh, displayed and it was followed up by uh, artillery fire. In another incident, uh, there were uh, troops dressed in civilian clothes that appeared to, uh, to welcome the forces and then ambush them. So uh, there, there are a number of incidents occurring uh, to the rear of the main combat forces. Uh, none, of, none of these incidents, however, I would uh, characterize as posing a danger to uh, the, uh, the overall success of the mission or the thrust of the main forces towards Baghdad. And of course, being a member of the United States...